What would we witness if a human could observe light while moving at the same speed as that very light? This is not just a scientific question but a deep test of the limits of reality as we understand it today. As your speed increases, time begins warping dramatically, following Einstein's theory of relativity with eerie precision. You are not merely moving fast, you are sliding across the stretched fabric of space-time itself. Approaching light speed compresses everything ahead into a single blinding point of concentrated blue-shifted energy. This is the relativistic Doppler effect, forcing all incoming light to shift violently into extremely high-energy blue wavelengths. Meanwhile, light behind you stretches into long red waves, giving the impression the universe itself is slowing down. Your field of vision collapses forward, erasing nearly all sense of sideways as space flattens into a tunnel. This is Lorentz contraction space, a head shrinks drastically, as if compressed by an invisible cosmic force. If you attempted to look into a mirror at this speed, what strange reflection would stare back at you? You would see almost nothing because light cannot return to your eyes in the usual reflective path. This effectively means you become visually invisible to yourself, lost in relativistic geometry. Yet the strangest transformation occurs when your velocity matches the speed of light. Modern physics states nothing with mass can reach light speed since it requires infinite energy. But imagine breaking the rule inside a controlled scientific thought experiment. At light speed, time for you completely stops, freezing every internal process. All motion around you ceases too, no past, no future, only an eternal present. All motion around you ceases too, no past, no future, only an eternal present. This explains why physicists say light experiences no time passage. A photon born billions of years ago feels no time in its own frame. Observing light at this velocity reveals space-time twisting and breaking intuition. Every star ahead converges into a single overwhelming point. The sky behind becomes perfect darkness, erased from existence. You observe not the universe, but the limits of human perception. Reality may depend on the speed at which you experience it. Two people moving at different speeds measure time differently, proven by experiments. At extreme velocity, familiar rules dissolve into relativistic distortions. Distorted light makes the universe behave unpredictably. This raises the question, is the speed of light our final boundary of understanding? A deeper layer of reality may exist, unaffected by relativistic limits. Quantum space-time theory suggests light is just a surface layer. Observing light at light speed reveals only the universe's outer shell. We may see limits instead of the universe's true essence. Every boundary opens new questions fueling exploration. This journey shows observing light at light speed is only the beginning.